is that we're announcing the former International Order of Odd Fellows Lodge here at 124 Dennis at the site of the new, new Youth Wellness of Algoma. So we're very excited to have this uh, announced as the site because we see a lot of great things happening for young people in our community. We are really hoping that we can open the doors later this year, but there's a lot of work that needs to happen to this building, so it's re we're really at the mercy of the timeline mm -hmm. to get the building rehabbed. But our goal is ideally late fall, maybe early winter. So this uh, hub is really designed for youth 12 to 25 years of age. And there'll be a number of services that are available to, to youth. Why uh, hub was so important to us as a community is that we know there's a lot of need in our community. The challenge is to try to find where you can get that help. It's, there's a lot of services, but it's a maze of services. Sometimes, you know what, if there's too much effort to try and get those services, we know that some people are not getting them. So like having one place, it's like a one-stop shop, where you can get the services they need. We'll have a nurse, uh, nurse practitioner here, the health needs will be met. We have Alcoma Public Health as a partner. Oh, great. We have the John Howard Society, the Canadian Mental Health Association, we have us with the Mental Health and Addictions Counseling. We have the Indian Friendship <laughs> Center. Uh, and, and the CAS is just a few of our partners that will be providing services. We know every day there are more partners that are excited now that we've uh, shared that we have this up that will come and we welcome our community groups and partners. Soya is here, okay. AMH is here. Uh, we really hope to animate this space in a way that youth can uh, have their needs but also their leisure time in a very safe and welcoming place. So we have a, a great commercial kitchen here. So we, we plan to feed a lot of youth. Plan for youth to learn how to feed themselves. We've got partnerships that will happen in Harvest Algoma, Goes for Good. Uh, in sourcing food, they'll have laundry facilities, they'll have a shower, so uh, youth can, can access those uh, facilities. We'll have a pool table, we'll have uh, instruments, we'll have computers, uh, free internet that youth can access. In addition, that there will be some office space where you can, can access the services they need.